How may I be of assistance to you, Padawan? What is it you would like to speak to me about? After my father died, my mother was left to support me alone. A single, non-human woman, living in one of the worst, most violent slums on Taras. It was not easy for her. When my father was killed, it seemed that something in her began to die as well. She worked. She worked as hard as she was able. But over time, she began to waste away. I later learned that she was unable to get enough money to feed both of us, and had to start borrowing from the exchange. A band of cutthroats and smugglers. But even that was not enough. She hid what she was doing from me. She gave most of her food to me so that I would be strong, but she herself was suffering deeply from it. In the end, she could go on no longer, and collapsed at the cantina where she worked one day. She never recovered. There was nothing really that I could do for her. She left me no money, and no doctor would see her without being paid first. I sat by her bed for days as she lay there dying. I never want that to happen to someone I care about ever again. But there was still the money she had borrowed. She had never paid it back and made no provisions for her death. You must understand. The exchange is brutal. They care nothing for the life of a sentient being. They are the major suppliers of slaves on Terrace. They thought it would be appropriate that, with my mother owing them money, the debt should be passed on to me. And with no way to pay, they took me by force. You have no idea what it is like to be bound like a beast and treated as such. It was the worst time of my life. They treated me like livestock. They were waiting for a buyer to give them some credit for me when the Jedi came to fight the Mandalorians. The Jedi could not abide by what they saw there, and drove the exchange from the face of the world, freeing those of us imprisoned there. But the Jedi soon left to fight their war, and I was left with a dream. I swore that I would become a Jedi. As soon as I had enough money to do it, I bought passage on a freighter headed for Dantooine, and we both know what has happened since then. I am grateful to you for having given me the opportunity to fulfill my dream, rather than become what I hated. Someday, I may make it up to you, but for now, let us keep on the task at hand.